This is a GoPro 11 accessory that you must have in your bag. It's by a company called HSU and they do fantastic accessories for GoPros. This is the new magnetic mount by HSU. So in the box you get your magnetic mount. You have a, a 360 ball head adapter that will go on the top. You also get uh, one of those thumb screw tighteners. It's got uh, the HSU, that's the tripod mount, and it's got a little wristband as well. Okay, so how do we put it all together? So basically what you do is you take the magnetic plate the circular plate that's here and you attach the ball head to the plate okay then what you do is you take your hsu tripod adapter and you apply that to the bottom of your gopro hero 11. so i have my gopro hero 11 here and that basically goes on to i like to mount mine away from the door so i put the thumb screw actually away from the door because then it doesn't get in the way so, fairly solid little tripod adapter that's here, okay? So then once you have your tripod adapter connected to the bottom of your GoPro Hero 11, that then attaches right here to your ball head, and then you can basically attach that to anything that's magnetic. Maybe, just maybe, you have a crowbar that you want to attach it to. Maybe you want to attach it to your refrigerator. Your toaster, your breadboard, but one of the best uses for the new HSU magnetic mount is of course going to be on a car. So let's take her out for a test drive. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to test it on top of the car. So. Normally I would mount my GoPro on the little clip that I have here, but today we're going to try the magnetic mount and see how that goes. So we'll attach it here, the safest option first on top, and we'll see how it stays on. Ooh, did you hear that? Like that's solid. Yes, I do have a camera strapped to the top of my car. Yeah, so it looks like it survived on top of the car. So next thing what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put it on the side and let's see. It's the good advantage about this is normally I'd have a mount that's here. So at least with a magnetic mount, it's gonna allow me to put it anywhere on the car and it's gonna stay still. So. Uh, Let's see and put it in another couple of positions and we're going to take a look at them right now. I'm getting some really strange looks at the moment so uh, what I've done now is I've just mounted it on the front of the car facing towards me um, but if you're going doing that what you're probably going to need is some type of polarizer filter actually on your GoPro because it's not going to get through the glare of the windscreen so if you are going to put it on the front but it might be nice for a time lapse or something like that so let's just see what it looks like from the front looking back at the car. <laughs> Another 
great option or another great angle that you could use is basically having your window down and placing the magnetic GoPro mount just here, like so. And you're gonna get a fantastic angle. Just make sure that you have enough, that it's solid enough. So if I just place it here right now, I'm gonna turn that on, start to record. And there we have it. We have another great angle that's gonna allow you for some fantastic view. <laughs> So, is the new HSU uh, magnetic mount worth it? I think absolutely. The versatility of it is absolutely fantastic, especially if you're mounting it on a car. Some great options with it. So, I'll put a link in the description below as to where you can get it, and uh, definitely one you need to add in your bag. So, thanks very much, folks, for joining me, and hope to see you all again very, very soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Cheers.